Representing Australia. On the ice now, representing Australia, the two-time Australian Crane. national champion, Kailani Crane. 19 years old, trains in Los Angeles with Tiffany Chin. Plans to open this program with the footwork triple flip. A little tight on the reach, but a very nice landing. Entering the second half of this short program. They do. Triple loop, triple loop combination. And a very nice double axle to round out the jumping passes. on the Grand Prix, coming off the best competition of her career, a win at Nebelhorn Trophy last month. And that win secured a spot for Australia for the ladies at next year's Olympics. And after that win, she was invited to Skate Canada. And what did she say about that? She is beyond excited to be here. Here's a look at that opening triple flip. It didn't look like it pressed all the way through the gliding foot on the takeoff, but still gets enough to complete the rotation. But here's a look at that triple loop, triple loop combination. You have to think on such a difficult combo that they will tend to look at the replay of the landing of the second jump to make sure that she got the rotation. But that is a very difficult combination, particularly in the short program. You don't quite have the wiggle room if you're off on a loop combo. A triple toe combo, you can kind of correct, get back over the hip, but there's not as much stability when you're coming down with that free foot in front. So very impressive and ambitious to go for such a difficult combination, especially in the second half of this short program. So you can see how skaters can start to build momentum in that Challenger series before the Grand Prix even starts. Absolutely. 
54.96, that's a couple of points lower than she scored at Nebelhorn, but Nebelhorn, again, that was a personal best score for her in the short program. With a score at 54, you have to think that they gave her an under on that second triple loop. Please mark, uh, the next